How you guys doing? So, so I didn't know all that stuff that Sam said. <laughs> I didn't know I was eight. I'm eight. That's pretty good. That's interesting. Um, so, I'd like to introduce myself. I'm Ruben Drones, obviously. Sam just told you guys. Um, I didn't really uh, prepare a speech because me and my wife were on vacation in Hawaii for, for the last week or so. Um, but, you know, I, I've been playing, I've played football for over 20 years. Um, and the, not the funny thing, but the thing is, is that throughout that 20 years of playing football, I had no idea what TBI was. I had no information about it. I didn't know that football would even cause those type of injuries. I mean, I knew there was some, you know, knee problems, a couple of, you know, shoulder injuries, and maybe some neck problems and spine things going on. Um, but I had no idea the effects of brain injuries until after I retired in 2009. And just being able to see the research on what's going on and looking at some of the symptoms. This, you know, Dr. Lori's had a, a list of symptoms up there that, you know, that people suffer from TBIs and I probably have about five to eight of them. And, um, and unfortunately, you know, those things do take effect and, and do control your life um, unexpectedly. And, and you know, I love it. I have a lovely wife, Emily, sitting here that really is patient with me <laughs> because I do. Sorry, keep going. You know, I do suffer from a little bit of depression at times. She, she probably doesn't know how much, but um, I do suffer from a little bit of depression, um, anger issues, mood swings. Um, you know, um, I've, I've actually been uh, diagnosed with a, a, a bit of a depression. I mean, not depression, but um, dementia. Um, and I'm only 38 years old, which is kind of sad here. But um, um, you know, I, I've actually had some scans in my brain, and I was looking at some of these brains of some of these military vets, and um, and I was like, whoa, that that looks like mine. You know, um, from what you know, what a lot of the neurologists have told me is the bruising under a football player's skull is really very, very difficult to to heal um, because of all the pounding. And, the, and you know, you're, you're basically your brain is hitting on. I'm sorry, you got to eat. <laughs> your, your brain is hitting on all bone, and so it's, you know, from um, looking at the images of my brain, looking at the images of a linebacker's brain, and looking at the images of a um, offensive lineman's brain, which is probably the worst brain I've ever seen. Um, you know, it, usually you see a, a brain that's kind of smooth over, you know, but these guys, I mean, you can take a sponge and and squeeze it and all the indentations in that, in that sponge is looking, that's how alignment the brain looks. Um, and, and um, you know, so playing, playing, over, playing over 20 years, um, I've probably had, um, <laughs> on record, I've probably had um, three concussions on record. Um, two of them which, in which I was um, completely knocked out. Um, and the other ones, but with, with those three, I probably had over a thousand or more um, self-concussive blows. Um, and those are the, you know, the sparkles, uh, the little lights, you know, those lights in the sky that you see. And, you know.